basically doing with Scoot is we're creating a paradigm shift and we're saying now that we're exchanging these large amounts of information, we need a completely different way to do it. Files are getting bigger and bigger, they're not getting smaller. The internet is becoming a rich media experience. So email and FTP, these older ways of handling those large files, really don't support the bill. I mean, they really can't fulfill that. So Scoot is perfectly positioned to help move those large files, regardless of size and format. Scoot across cyberspace, massive amounts of video, photos, journals, and music. 65 gigabytes, or 10 feature length films worth of data. No hassles with email or FTP, no crashing the system. The difference between Scoot and other technologies that are like it is that it's so user friendly. Go drag it, scoot that file. I scooted a file. Great technology for people and not machines um, makes all the difference. And I think that, you know, Scoot is letting us walk our talk. With other technologies such as FTP and email, you have to worry about things like spam filters, really large files bouncing uh, back to you, and uh, especially with FTP, you have to worry about getting an FTP server uh, set up. Uh, and then, you know, having to hand out passwords and that kind of a thing. Um, with Scoot, we call it a fire and forget interface. And what that means is you put the file into the Scoot space and it gets to your recipients uh, no problem. This, this is even if you close your laptop down or if you unplug your laptop, Scoot detects these changes in the system and will automatically um, bridge over them for you. And the neat thing about Scoot is that you can establish that community of interest, the people that you, you know, exchange information with on a frequent basis. Once you establish that, you don't have to recreate it each time. Like whenever you send an email, you have to enter the email address each time. But the Scoot allows you to set up that network or create a brand new network. So it's easy all the way around. Scoot, the moment that you put a file in the Scoot space, what happens is that the recipient of the file immediately sees an icon. So even though that person hasn't received the entire file, um, that person knows at least that the file is coming. You have to rely on a public forum to share private information. So we're creating essentially an ad hoc family private network. Where information is not only exchanged, but can be shared at the same time. Gomez calls it their private family hub. So it's available 24 hours a day. They can go into any computer. In fact, even our own servers that the file passes through, uh, they don't get to see what the contents are. So we protect our user in that way. Think about attorneys, large documents. Think about the medical community. You know, they have films that they're exchanging between doctors. We're really focused on technology and improving the way people communicate and, and improving their lives.